So I thought I'd just make a quick video because I know from experience how easy it is to start working on a game and then you slowly start losing that progress and that will to live and then you end up just never finishing it. I'm sure that if you're interested in game development, you either have not even attempted it or you have dozens of projects that never got finished. So today I thought I'd share my very simple tips for letting this not happen. And it's really, really easy. First of all, the most important rule, my golden rule, never have a 0% day. And what I mean by that is sometimes you just are like, ugh, I don't want to do it, and you don't do anything. Doing a tiny bit of work every day or even every week eventually adds up. If you do nothing, it adds up to nothing. And it's better to do something slow than to just not do it at all. So what do I mean by doing this? It's very simple. Break down large tasks into smaller ones. That's a really, really good place to start. It feels really good to be able to cross things off of lists, like check mark, I got that done. Okay, I did this. All right, I completed that. It makes you feel encouraged and like you're actually getting your game finished. But it really helps to break down really big tasks into smaller ones because, for example, creating a level might be just too big of a task to do in one day and then you don't finish it and you feel bad about it or it could take you multiple days and you just get frustrated. So instead of your goal being finish this level or make this level, how about break it into three pieces? Number one, lay out the room. That's just like the walls and the floor and the ceiling and the doors and maybe some windows, whatever. And then two, add the furniture. That's where you start placing the cabinets and the couch and the TV and whatever other stuff and get it the way you're, you're wanting it to look. And then lastly, three, add the game mechanics. That's where you would add, like, if you examine the wall, like, here's a painting of whatever. And, you know, uh, you put the key in the drawer that the player can find, all those little things. And now you've turned something that was a giant, scary task into three small, simple tasks that you could do probably... <laughs> in very little time. I guess it depends on what game you're making, but I think you see what I'm getting at. This has kind of been my life hack for game development and a couple other things because it's just, it's it's so much easier to do smaller tasks. And I found this to be really helpful for things in game development that just aren't enjoyable for you personally. Some of the parts of game dev can be boring or frustrating depending on what your skills are. And if it's something you just don't enjoy doing, then break it down Break it down into as many small pieces as you need to, and that's it. Never have a 0% day. That's it. That's the video. That's the message. So um, very easy to remember. I hope that helps because it, it has helped me so much. All right, there you go. Go drink some water. Have a nice day.